Jimmy Dang from Maximum PC here. We're here at NVIDIA's booth uh, checking out uh, the Shield, uh, sort of uh, portable, well, PC. It's like a portable handheld PC. And I'm here speaking with uh, James Wang. Yes. And uh, can you tell us about the, the device and how it works? Of course. So this is our latest, latest portable handheld. Um, it's powered by Tegra 4, which is our latest um, mobile processor. It's six times more powerful than Tegra 3, so it's got a lot of graphics force power. Uh, what you see here is a 5-inch 720p display, um, very high pixel density, so you're not going to notice uh, you know, the individual pixels at normal viewing distance. It's very high quality. And also, we've spent a lot of time building a full-size controller with Project Shield so that you, know, you can really play your games uh, for a long time and get very high accuracy, too. You have your shoulder buttons as well as the uh, analog joysticks here. So, you know, it runs stock Android. You press the middle of the uh, NVIDIA button and you kind of get taken to the game world here. We have Jensen's PC here streaming. Um, you can also play games like Hawk and Bloodsword and uh, all the latest Android games. So here's kind of real boxing, which is a real cool looking boxing game that's uh, in development for uh, Android and uh, it's pretty well optimized for Tegra here. These speakers here we've custom designed in-house, really, really uh, high performance. And these ports here you can see uh, provide low frequency response as well. You'll notice that the sound is going to be even better than most laptops you'll try. So I'll give you a quick demo of uh, this game and hopefully you like it. Now, are you guys working with uh, Android developers as well to create games? I know you guys do some stuff with Hawking and all that, right? Absolutely. We have a world-class developer relations program. Um, we are working with, obviously, uh, a lot of PC game developers, and we're also, this team is uh, working with all the best Android developers to make sure these games work well with the controller and have really, really top-notch graphics. So one, of the, one of the, I guess, the, uh, the things that people uh, dig Android games for is that most of the games, as of right now, they're not that good, and I think most of the reason why is because there hasn't been a real dedicated hardcore controller to support you know, in-depth games, and obviously you guys are supporting that with, with the Shield. Do you guys hope uh, that this will be the new sort of standard platform for Android gaming? We do certainly uh, hope to do that. I mean, you're right, exactly. Right now, there hasn't been much of a standard, and developers haven't had something to rally to. Uh, I think with NVIDIA behind it and our developers program, and this really... Uh, quite outstanding controller, we hope they'll definitely rally behind it. Okay, cool. All right. And uh, the uh, price and release date? So we're targeting Q2 for release, and uh, price information will be uh, coming out soon. Cool. All right, thank you, Dave. Thank you.